Hi, welcome to CADSTAR.org. I want to talk about our class, Sarah Happens. You know, I often get the question, is this class applicable to me? I've been using the CEREC five, seven years, or maybe one month. Doesn't really matter because in Sarah Happens, what we do is we focus on the fundamental principles of restorative dentistry as applied to the posterior mouth. Even though we place in a few tidbits and pearls about anterior teeth, our focus is on good posterior ceramic dentistry. And what I've learned from my 25 years of experience of doing adhesive dentistry with ceramics, I have applied to CAD CAM. And the principles are sound because it's what I do every day. I would invite you to download your PDF file of this brochure for the Sarah Cappins and look at the questions at the bottom of the page. These are some of the questions I would ask you. Number one is, are your restorations dropping in seamlessly, particularly if you're doing quadrant dentistry from one virtual die? They should be if we're applying the principles right of restorative dentistry and understanding how the CEREC works through that. Number two is, how's your occlusion? Is it going fairly seamlessly for you? Or are you having to adjust occlusion quite a bit? You know, I hate that when you've designed a beautiful restoration, you seat it, and then before you know it, you're adjusting all that beautiful anatomy away and you just don't have that rush. Well, I don't want that to happen. And the CEREC, the metric system in the CEREC should work for us if we're putting our parameters in the right adjustments for your machine. And they're all pretty much the same. How's your post-op sensitivity doing? Most post-op sensitivity comes from occlusion in my practice and we don't see it very much because we're managing occlusion and the way we set up our system. And what I have found with CEREC is that if you prepare your clinical theater right, your optical impression should be seamless. Your design should be seamless and the machine will do most of that for you without us dinking and messing up the virtual aspects of the design. The CEREC should do most of that for us. Then we apply the principles of our parameters or our occlusion in an approximal contacts are on and our restoration seat. So when we seat them in the mouth and bond them in using a seamless adhesive system, the system should be quite complete. And that's what CEREC happens is all about. It's the fundamentals of good posterior adhesive ceramic dentistry. And what I have found from my years of practice is that I, as I've moved into the CEREC system, it was seamless for me because I already had the basics down. And that's what I like to share with you. Simplicity to maximize your effects in the mouth is what CEREC is all about. One thing that's really important to me here at CADSTAR is I've kept our continuum hands-on classes small so I can give you adequate one-on-one -on -one personalized tutoring. And that's really important to me because what I've seen is that when I understand your learning style and where you're at, we can customize it so you can really take it a long way. So when you leave this class, you go out with that new juiced energy and you can't wait to get back to your practice and apply the principles because that will make your CEREC fly for you. And that's what it's all about is good fundamental posterior ceramic dentistry. And we happen to use the CEREC to do it. And so if you look at the six questions and you think you can't answer more than two of those on a consistent basis as yes, then this class would be great for you. And so I'd like to invite you to take CEREC happens so your CEREC and your ceramic restorative dentistry is walking really smooth for you. See you then. Look at that incisal edge. Uh-huh. Brag it up. Now go uh -huh. go through and finish the line angles like I showed you. Uh -huh. And then use die shine and then I want to see it. And then we're gonna get on a video. We're we're together. <laughs> <laughs> this, this guy is hot. Let me tell you, no, right. I have learned more at this class from them than they have learned from me because that happens every time. I'm having a great time at this class because Dee here is from Las Vegas and uh, she's very artistic. And she has taken this technology to a new level of artistry and perfection. What do you have to say about that? Uh, I'm learning a lot. I am very thankful to be here. Thank you, Dr. Clan and Dr. Rina. Give me five. <laughs> yeah. Um, the class is awesome. Do you see it one more time? Just like really like gut, gut it out. The class is awesome. You're going to the website now.